Thank you to my amazing Patreons for believing in me and making it possible for me to continue creating content. Your support not only keeps the channel going, but also allows me to explore new ideas, improve production quality, and share even more of what I'm passionate about. I truly couldn't have done this without my supporters. If you wish to be part of my Patreon, please go to this URL. While clearing my own stuff, I rediscovered my childhood drawings. What you're about to see are the drawings I have done around the age of 11. Join me on this nostalgic journey back to our innocent beginnings as artists. When we picked up a pencil not for work or obligation, but simply because the artist within us yearns to express itself. Yeah, I was really into Power Rangers back then. There is going to be a lot of Power Rangers, so <laughs> you've been warned. In today's context, Power Rangers is like, whatever. However, in its heydays, it created quite a stir. I wonder if any of you watching this have experienced that era where it reigned supreme and captivated the masses. I wish I could communicate with my younger self and ask him why he chose to draw the helmet in this particular way, with the base of the helmet being completely flat. It seemed to be a style that my younger self decided on. Mm, I don't think my handwriting has improved since. Ooh, bandy lights. <laughs> did the show ever did that? I don't remember. <laughs> Oh man, I loved the command center. When I was a kid, I would come closer to the screen and look at the details on the panels with all the blinkies when the command center is on. I remember wishing and wanting so much to visit the command center. Not the exterior, the interior. When my grandfather bought me the command center module, I would play with it and let my imagination run wild thinking of all kinds of storylines. I also went through a Disney phase, as with most kids during my time. Ooh, the Rangers and their weapons. What have you lost as you grew up? What have you gained? I believe I drew this after attending a drawing lesson for kids that my mom bought me too. Thanks, mom. Disney stuff. Hmm, I was given a book on how to draw dinosaurs for kids and I just followed its drawing instructions back then. Ah, uh, Doraemon. Every kid in my time knows about Doraemon. I believe I drew this from a book on drawing generic characters. Mm-hmm. Okay. The Mega Dragon Sword. The White Ranger.
<laughs> ay, 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 ay. Ah, this is from the very first Power Ranger movie. Yep, my proportions were all over the place back when I was a kid. Wait, I think it's still the case now. I lose interest in drawing dinosaurs pretty quickly. I think my favorite is still Triceratops. More Megazords. Mickey Mouse. And finally, Megazord and Rangers. And this is the final piece that marks the end of my childhood drawings. Thank you for this nostalgic walk with me. You have all experienced a small piece of my childhood. I hope to see you all soon again. Have a good rest. This is Bracel Jack, signing off.